Wood ears, scientifically known as Auricularia auricula judi, are famous both in nature and in kitchens across Asia. These fungi are technically edible and almost flavorless, but they have a unique crunchy, springy texture that stays crisp even after long cooking. That resilience makes them popular in soups, broths, and stir-fries, where they act more like a textural ingredient than a source of taste. In the wild, wood ears are easy to recognize. They grow as thin, curved, ear-like lobes on fallen branches and decaying hardwood, with a surface that feels soft, rubbery, and slightly gelatinous, almost like natural silicone. Fresh specimens range from amber-brown to deep reddish-brown, and their semi-translucent folds look striking when illuminated by moisture. Wood ears are remarkable for how they manage water. After rainfall, they absorb moisture rapidly and swell into their full, hydrated form. During dry periods, they contract into tough, leathery discs that can persist for weeks. As soon as humidity returns, they rehydrate and become jelly-like again, an adaptation that helps them survive unpredictable forest conditions. From a biological standpoint, wood ears are saprobic basidiomycetes. They break down the cellulose and hemicellulose in dead wood, helping recycle nutrients locked inside logs and branches. Their spore-bearing surface is smooth rather than gilled or porous. And under the microscope, they show a layered gelatinous structure unique to jelly fungi. This combination of ecological importance, unusual hydration strategy, and culinary relevance makes wood ears one of the most intriguing fungal groups found on forest wood.